So here is the first phone with the Helio G90T gaming processor and it's the Redmi Note 8 Pro which is launched in China. So let's discuss about this phone further in the video. So hi there this is Priyanshu and you are watching all about technology and today we are just gonna talk about the Redmi Note 8 Pro which is the first phone coming with the Helio G90T gaming processor and it is the successor of the Redmi Note 7 Pro which is a quite popular smartphone in China and in India and this is the uh, this phone comes with quite a lot of upgrade over the Note 7 Pro so what are they let's discuss in this video further. So firstly talking about the display so here the display is also upgraded although it's the full HD plus display having the 90% screen to body ratio and 19.5 is to 9 aspect ratio but it is the 6.53 at display so it's uh, the size of the display has been increased from 6.3 to 6.5 so definitely it is good for viewing uh, watching movies and playing games and even its design has been a lot of there are a lot of upgrades in its design though both the front and the back has the glass uh, the back also has the glass and it is the similar with the note with the, with the Gorilla Glass 5 on both front as well as back so you get a really good protection although you have to use the case even the camera modules has been changed the placement of the camera module has been changed from left side to the middle and it looks quite good and similar to the k20 and the k20 pro series and then now coming to the processor part so here it comes with the all new helio g90 t gaming octa core processor which is a 12 nm based processor uh, and when compared to the snapdragon 730 and 730g the helio 9 helio g90 t just outperform and beat Snapdragon 730 and 730G in every aspect in benchmark of Antutu Antutu benchmark, Geekbench or 3D marks. So definitely when coming to performance it is going to give you some really great performance and even better than the K20 Pro, K, sorry K20 uh, in the price tag it has been launched above 20k in India and it is expected to note 8 Pro coming under 20k and in this price range 8 and um, Redmi Note 8 Pro is going to be a really a great deal in terms of performance. Not only performance but the camera module has been upgraded uh, quite uh, massively because uh, the previous Note 7 Pro comes with the Sony uh, MX4, uh, 586 48 megapixel sensor but this time it's the Samsung 64 megapixel isocell bright GW1 sensor and even there are um, code camera setup in this the redmi note 8 pro so it's having a 64 megapixel primary sensor with this 8 megapixel ultra wide angle lens 2 megapixel depth field uh, depth sensor while a 2 megapixel macro shot just that like what realme 5 pro and realme 5 ha uh, camera modules have even though the realme 5 pro camera module is only 48 megapixel and the realme xt comes with the 64 megapixel so it is competing with the realme uh, xt in terms of uh, camera modules now and coming to battery so when uh, overall coming to the camera department we can expect some pretty good shots from this because this uh, this, this six, uh, samsung 64 megapixel sensor is really quite good sensor when coming to the previous uh, the previous uh, 48 megapixel samsung or sony's uh, camera sensor now coming to battery it comes with 4000 mh battery which is quite good so you can expect some pretty good battery life battery life uh, and it also supports that 18 volt fast charging so although you won't getting the fast charger in the box so if you are talk about overall performance of the overall you know about the uh, note 8 pro so it is a really huge improvement over the uh, redmi note 7 pro because it has a better sensor it comes with quad camera it has the better 64 megapixel sensor comparing to the 48 megapixel in the note 7 pro it has a uh, much better actually huge improvement in terms of performance because the uh, g90t is actually a much powerful performance even it is actually better than the 730 so 730 and 730g from snapdragon so it, it's actually much better than the 675 uh, from snapdragon used in the note 7 pro so definitely in terms of performance it's a really great smartphone and it also even also has a really great design coming to when comparing to the Note 7 Pro. So what do you think about this smartphone? Because for me, it's just a really great deal and we can expect it under 20k in India. 
so definitely it is going to be a really great and one of the best performing smartphones with 20k uh, even in terms of camera it is a really great smartphone so what do you think about this smartphone tell me in the comment section if you like the video hit the like button if you dislike the video hit the dislike button if you haven't subscribed and like the video subscribe it hit the bell icon so that you get notified every time we upload a new video until then this is Priyanshu signing off